you know, certainly there was a lot of nervousness. We haven't dealt with a pandemic like this before. So when it first started, there was a lot of obviously anxiety around what this could mean. Um, we had a lot of discussions with our industry groups, things can we do to make sure that you feel comfortable and are able to support this. Located behind me is Grope Bridge. We know that this project has caused many delays for commuters over the past few years. And that is why we're excited to share with you that Grope Bridge will open to all four lanes of traffic to commuters on Monday morning. Phase one construction of Imagine Jasper Avenue from 109th Street to 114th Street is also moving along on schedule. The Imagine Jasper Avenue project will revitalize the roadway from 109th Street to 124th Street to create welcoming spaces and enhance pe pedestrian areas while maintaining access for commuters and businesses. Recently, over the last few weeks, we were also able to get a, a, an early start on the pre-grading and earthworks to support the first stage of the Twilliger Expressway project. Our neighborhood renewal program is about to wrap up in 10 neighborhoods this year, with alley work continuing in three Edmonton neighborhoods. Crews renewed more than 100 kilometers of, of roadway and sidewalk with more than 10 kilometers of alleys in 2020. What's been much well documented and spoken about, and that's our Valley Line Southeast project, which we all know is, is trending late.